Oh, there you go. Hey, yo, what's up? Yeah, we out here on the, uh, we on, out here on Thanksgiving Eve in Columbus, Ohio. And we just talking about Thanksgiving. And notice, like, every day after Thanksgiving, the day after Thanksgiving, you'll notice, you'll see steam coming up out the sewers. You know what I'm saying? You'll be, be, right be a nasty smell in the air because everybody's shitting all that food they ate, all that pork. Chicky chow chow. Can I ask you a question? You play Mortal Kombat? Y'all yeah, <laughs> uh, celebrate Thanksgiving and things like that. You celebrate Christmas? Are you a homosexual? Fuck you then. I just yeah. want to ask you a question. Goddamn Chinese Fuck motherfuckers, food. man. Y'all think you're taking Fuck over? Down children, yeah, y'all children. Y'all y'all coming over Heathens. here. You gotta watch it. These godless bastards. Yeah, they got they atheists, they godless, they communists. Because China is a communist country. And they worship Karl Marx, a goddamn Jew, a so-called Jew, a goddamn Edomite. You know what I mean? They worship they worship Karl Marx. That's like that's like their idol. Hey, look at these Chinese, they're a bunch of faggots, man. A bunch of weirdos. If you talk to them, they get scared. You know what? Those motherfuckers buying up more shit than. That's the third uh, group of moeds that I've seen while we was walking down here. Walking, yeah. Cause they, cause, it, Cause America's flooding, Amer America is purposely flooding this country. The government is pur purposely flooding this country with heathens from countries like China, India, Saudi Arabia, Somalia. They making sure they bring plenty of Somalians over here just to fuck us up, you know what I mean? And all these heathens, they bringing diseases over here. You know what I'm saying? And they bringing all their heathen ways with them. And they, they, don't, they don't associate with us. They ain't gonna do, you know what I mean? You don't see Chinese people hanging out there. They won't even talk to you. They ain't wanna talk to us. They don't even speak goddamn in English. <laughs> hey, but some of them heathens that come over here be Israelites, so. Yeah, a lot of them. Yeah, we talked to a couple of cool, cool ones up a couple years ago. Yeah, it was a couple of cool ones. Yeah. Chinese was too. One of them was an obvious a straight up Jake, and he was feeling this word too, man. Mm -hmm. I remember that. Actually, uh, um, yeah, we talked. It was an Arab. Remember the Arab dude? Him, he was cussing his bull out. Oh yeah, it said how he was. You were here? Yeah. Oh damn! How long ago was that? Yeah. Damn. That was a while ago. Because he, last cause he, year, maybe he early there, last year. He had the, uh, he, had his, he had his little shell toe Adidas on and shit. It had to be recent because he was here. Man. Yeah, it was like uh, it was last year. Or maybe beginning of this year. Oh, was still in the morning. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He was listening, and he told his boy that, see, I told him he was trying to walk away. He was cussing him out. Oh, when he was walking away. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yo, that's how Esau's plan backfired. Because that's why we set up, that's why the Lord set the prophets up to start off over in so-called America first. Because this got people of all nations here, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Just like Paul went to Rome, just like you got the Book of Romans. Well, America's a modern day Rome. You got people from all countries coming over here. And so when they hear this word, they go back to their home country, then they tell their families about this word. You know what I'm saying? Just like, just like when you get on the internet. You get on the internet, you be hitting people with scriptures. Man, we got people from India watching our videos. We got people watching our videos in Saudi Arabia. You know what I'm saying? They might watch a video. Um, Ghana. Ghana, uh, Germany, Switzerland, all over the place, all in all countries. Iceland. Oh, there probably is a... That, that, that ham I see, that ham I, that's Africa. Oh, you Australia. Got a lot of Jakes that live over there in Ghana. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I was watching this yeah. 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 church, too. Going off like a yeah. Yeah, yeah. Like to Jesus Christ. And then got, and then got these bitches got some fat, juicy asses. And they lively too. And they and they lively. Lively. I saw them motherfuckers out there in left church. Then they go get ready for war. That's just one try. They actually go out finding an innocent child, killing that child, and they just eating that child before they go out to war. And they still doing that shit to this day, man. Over that way, the west, the west, west coast Africa. of Africa. The cannibal was the war. Yeah, I seen something that, something like that on YouTube. That's that page they hit me to. They do that again. Little small documentaries. Ice. Ice. I found that on Vice. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's good. Here you go, right here. This is Leviticus 26 33. And I will scatter you among the heathen and will draw out a sword after you, and your land shall be desolate and your cities wasted. So Israel scattered among the heathens. You know what I'm saying? So you got Israelites scattered among all nations. You got Israelites who look, who look like Saudi Arabians. 
They could be living in motherfucking Saudi Arabia and thinking they a goddamn Ishmaelite. Yep. And they worshiping Allah and they thinking Allah is the truth. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But they just lost. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, Israelites thinking they know that. Yeah, you got Israelite. Yeah, like Bruce Lee was an Israelite. He goddamn Chinese. So, but he really ain't Chinese. He ain't like the regular average goof. You know what I'm saying? He, 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 ain't, he ain't had that stupid look in his eye. Yeah, his spirit even drove him to But you ever read that book, he, uh, his book, what, that uh, Jack Kondo book? You ever read Bruce Lee's book? Your boy Bruce Lee, he, he was going, he was. I read his quote. He was thinking on a deeper level than most people. You yeah, know what I'm saying? That's how you know he knows about it. Yeah. I read a lot of his quotes. Even his own people shunned him. Uh, you know what I mean? The Chinese shunned him. They probably murdered his ass. He probably got murdered by the Chinese. You know what I'm saying? Sounds like you That wasn't his people. He was kicking in with the Israelites like Kareem Abdul Jabbar. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? He was kicking in with them. He didn't even show you in the movie. That, that movie that he came out with back in 93. That his first student, he opened up the store, was, uh, uh, was this big old dude. And he went with him everywhere. He even went with him to that underground fight. He went everywhere with him. The brother. Yeah, the brother. He went everywhere. Yeah. You see, the, it was a Jimmy Hendrix. It was a Jimmy Hendrix. BBC documentary. BBC did all of those documentaries. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, they found that he was actually hanging out with Bruce Lee and Seattle. Oh, oh, that's right. They from Seattle. Yeah. They grew. They was growing up together. And you know, Jimmy Hendrix is Israelite. That's proof we know who Israel is. What he's talking about that last week. Because Jimmy Hendrix is the greatest guitarist that has ever lived. You can't get around him, okay? That's because he's an Israelite. The Israelites got more skills than all these heathens. You mean, you mean, oh, what's up, bro? What's up, bro? Oh, we don't fuck with that shit, bro. Oh, I feel it. Uh, he, Thanksgiving, that's, I suggest a, you that's every day for real. I suggest you get out of that shit. You know what I'm saying? The Lord is disgusted with that shit, man. Thanksgiving. It's really that, yeah, well pretty much, yeah. There's some holidays you can't get into though. And I love you. But that's a different story. And we, you was talking about this right before you came up, but now check this out. Every year Thanksgiving is on what day? A Thursday. The last Thursday. No, every but it's on a Thursday. It ain't never on no Friday. It ain't on Sunday. It's on Thursday no matter what. Now, what does Thursday mean? Let's go through all the days of the week. Sunday is the day of the sun. Monday is mon is moon. Monday is the day of the moon. Tuesday is the day of tears. That's a uh, Norse god. Okay? Or it's a god. Or the, the, the Wednesday is Odin's day. You know what I'm saying? It, it comes, well, Wednesday actually means Odin's day or Odin. You know what Odin is? You ever see Santa Claus? Santa Claus is Odin. Okay, right. that's where it said that the, the image is wearing a little funny little hat. Odin wore a funny little hat Saint like that. St. Nicholas. Yeah, that, that go all was really St. Nicholas was a black man though, but that, that's something different. You see Zeus? Yeah, but then you got Thursday, but Thursday is Thor's day. Thor. Thor. God of Thunder. That's the, right, that's Odin's son. So that's right. why they that's why they always hold Christmas on Thursday because they worship in Thor. It go, it's a, it go back to that ancient Germanic practice. Right. Or the ancient right. Norse, you know what I'm saying? Not the ancient, you know. Like the Vikings, you know the Vikings worship Thor. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's why you had They, that they would sacrifice children to the gods. They sacrifice grown ass men to the gods. That's crazy. They did Check it all the time. They Check had to do it, you know what I'm saying? All I want is just chapter uh, verse 1 and 2 in Jeremiah 10. Starting at 10 and 1, Jeremiah 10 and 1. Hear ye, the point is in 2 though. Hear ye the word of the Lord. Hear it. Hear ye the word which the Lord speaketh unto you, O house of Israel. You have your Israel. Right? Israel. That's why the Bible always say Israel. It speak of the word to Israel. Right. It, don't, it don't say it, it always dealing with Israel every time. Right. It don't never fail. Thus, every time it's talking about Israel. Right. Here's the point. Thus said the Lord, learn not the way of the heathen and be not dismayed at the signs of heaven. The, sign the, of, the signs of heaven. Like Christmas, you know, it's an astrological thing. It really is dealing with the, the period of the winter solstice, you know what I'm saying? So it's really dealing with, just like Easter, dealing with the, uh, the equinox. But, uh, 
Yeah, that's all. So you ain't supposed to be dismayed at the signs of heaven. So have hope, you know what I'm saying? Because Christmas is also the worshiping of the sun. You know what I'm saying? In the ancient Roman Empire, the Romans, they worshiped a god called Sol Invictus. The soul, that's where you get words like solar. Right. You know what I'm saying? Solar, that go back to the Latin word soul. You know what I'm saying? Soul Invictus, the unconquered sun. But they, they worshiped him on December 25th every year. You know what I'm saying? So that, that, that's, that's so Christmas is really something. That's one of Sun and shit. Yep. And they use that, you know, they think they got more soul than everybody. Oh, soul, yeah, that's probably where the word soul probably do. Got, you know what I mean? It probably got something to do with that. Right. You never know. It's, you know, the East Tars niggas, it's some non spiritual niggas, man. Yeah. You know, they all in the dark. No light in them, man. No light in them. Talking about black people built the pyramids, they from Egypt. Actually, black people did build the pyramids. Yeah, they correct but they did, because that. that was, but it was Israelite stuff. Right. Okay, check it you out. You know what I'm saying? During slavery. Slavery when Massa was whooping our ass, but we don't see us celebrating these buildings and shit. Like you know what I mean? Okay. It's the same fucking thing. We build America as doing, on, on, you know, with you know, whack the act our backs with. Right. Now these clown ass niggas into Egyptology, they into that pyramid shit, man. When we was getting our asses whooped in, because them pyramids, we was under hard bondage. But, you know, I'm gonna get that. Let me get that. That's an X. Like, yeah, tough, really a hard exercise. bondage, right? Yeah, like all them statues of the pharaohs. They, you, you, you ever seen the movie? Uh, uh, everybody seems to take a man from Charles Heston. Yeah, some shit. But I mean, that's a badass movie. That's some right. shit. You know what I'm saying? Even, even though they fuck a lot of shit up, they get a lot of shit right. In. Like on the Ten Commandments. If you watch the movie, they actually got ancient Hebrew written on the Ten Commandments in the ancient Hebrew script. You know what I'm saying? But in that movie, they show you how all the slaves but was pulling them giant monuments, you know what I'm saying? You know how hard it is to pull one of them big ass statues? You know what I'm saying? You pull a big ass block and shit. This shit breaking your back. You got old ladies out there working. You know what I'm saying? Let me take this conversation to Twilight Zone. Actually, back then, we had far better technology. Oh, actually, they did. So, as slaves, and we were. It was our, our wisdom that built that whole fucking city up. And so, no of course, we got the technology also. If hey, we got right the dollars to that. build that city up, we got the technology to, to make it a little easier, you know? Hey, you hey, right about that, because they did have, because the way they cut the stones and everything. Precision. Yeah, precision they, they did cuts. have precision cuts on the stones. Smooth. They can't even do that today. They can't even fit. Uh, they can't even do they can't that. Even they, 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 with the technology that, right, right. Within the cracks. With the technology they got today, they can't even do it. They can't even build a chair here in our height. Hey, Derek, you, you got know, gloves? With that, that precision. You can have these gloves on. Oh, no, you hold uh, You need gloves? Fucking no, I got a leak real quick. You need use this one, buddy. Is that still going? Yeah. I'm fine. Are you good? You gotta go, you gotta go. You gotta go, you gotta go. Right. Oh yeah, but you're right. That's a good point though, because they did have to. But they were still the Israelites was the slavery though. Like Israel built Egypt up. You know what I'm saying? You can read the Bible and it tells you how Joseph, Joseph was the one who made Egypt great. You know what I'm saying? He saved them from that famine, mm -hmm. and Joseph had mm -hmm. all that wisdom and all that knowledge. Mm -hmm. But at, but where after uh, one of the pharaohs died, Joseph lost favor with that pharaoh. Because he didn't know him. He didn't, he didn't know him. Yeah, yeah. And he was like, man, fuck that nigga. And then they started, and the Egyptians really, Pretty much, that's what the fuck Egyptians yeah, started yeah. fucking the Israelites up after that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You figure years down the line. That's happened in America, though. Yeah, yeah Joseph yeah. was bad, man. Joseph saw the famine coming through it. I'm, I'm, I can't remember. Yeah, a dream. Was a vision? Was it a vision? Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. So they planned, he told Pharaoh and planned it ahead. Right. So, you know, he got, shit, he got on the, the good side of the Pharaoh. Man. You know, really, it was America, you know, America was, a spirit, it get, uh, I'll get a scripture. I was going to read the Exodus first. I'll go ahead and read that. Because America is a, 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 a spiritually known as Egypt, bro. America is the new Egypt. That's why you got a pyramid on the dollar. You know what I'm saying? Right. So oh, what you got? Um, Exodus 50 and... Um, uh, now, therefore, I fear you not. I will never shoot. Walk out of this. It's cold. I understand. Oh, man. Mm -hmm. you, you, man, you gotta get this You're getting this word, man. You're getting this word, bro. The code will just pass right over. It's that fire. We get bad hands with that fire. Right, but <laughs> this is uh, 50 and 20, uh, Genesis. 
Oh, yes, sir. You know, the scriptures say you got to be in season, out of season. You know what I'm saying? In season, I get ain't oh, nothing. Oh, here we go. Okay. Because, you know, back in, that, back in the day, you used to have to battle out the snow. It would be worse Wars. than this. Yeah, right. You know, yeah. get hit with, how you get hit with a battle axe while you out some cold ass weather? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so this ain't shit. A battle axe. So this ain't shit. Yeah, and it really you get hit to the head with a, <laughs> with a uh, yeah. what, what's one of the thing? A mace, get clubbed with a mace. God damn, man. That shit, you know what I'm saying? So we doing good. We all right. Right, right, right. So, it's, it's easy. Yeah, yeah. Okay, here's the Exodus 1. And I'm going to start at five. And all the souls that came out of the loins of Jacob were 70 souls. For so Joseph was in Egypt already. And Joseph died and all his brethren and all his generations. And the children of Israel were fruitful and increased abundantly and multiplied and waxed exceedingly mighty. And the land was filled with them. Yeah, so, yeah, Israel was exceedingly mighty. So, I mean, these some bad motherfuckers, man. Is, you know, Israel got skilled. That's why, this is why I started with you uh, yeah. here, because of what you said. Yeah, that's a good point, though. Um, exceedingly mighty, and the land was filled with them. Now there arose up a new king over Egypt, which knew not Joseph. Oh, yep. Which knew the new king, the, the new pharaoh, he ain't know Joseph. You know what I mean? So he fell out of favor. I'll keep going with that. This is more juice than that. Oh, I got a lot. You can read that whole point chapter. The point is on the next yep. oh, I can read it. Yeah, okay. And he said unto his people, Behold, the people of Israel. The, be, behold the people of the children of Israel are more and mightier than we come on let us deal wisely with them they said they're they more and mightier than we that's just like in America this, this is just like even today there's more Israelites in America than Edomites than the so called white people to control the place and imagine that All we're, elite, we're, we're way ahead. more than them we're way more than them yeah right we, we, are, we, we the majority population we're obviously yeah. mightier just like now but just like then we can take this devil down. All the Israel just wake the fuck up and be a dumbass. Just prove the most high. That's right. There you go. And he said unto his people, Behold, the people of the children of Israel are more and mightier than we. Come on, let us deal wisely with them, lest they multiply and it come to pass. Let us deal wisely, because they why that's what that wise that, that wisdom goes back to that science. You ever hear of eugenics? Eugenics. That's where they destroy your ass through uh, genetics, through science. You know what I'm saying? Uh, through abortion. Hey, read that again. Oh, you can keep going, whatever you got. Okay. Come on, let us deal wisely with them, lest they multiply, and it come to pass that when they're falling out any war, they join also unto our enemies and fight against us, and so get them up out of the land. Keep going. Therefore, they did set over them taskmasters to afflict them with their burdens and they built the pharaoh treasure cities they got taskmasters today in america you got politicians you know what i'm saying you got house of representatives you got two senators per state you know what i'm saying you got your job with your boss you ever got taskmasters somebody telling your ass what to do is, 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 they, is this a history lesson for uh brother no light and and, oh, uh, he, he's Sarah sovereign. Suit and and he's sovereign. But he's sovereign, though, right? <laughs> he think he's sovereign. Right, right. I have to get to my aunt's house, man. That's uh, true, bro. I don't want to get sick. <laughs> I'm already right, right I appreciate y'all. All, all right, right, man. Okay, bro. Yeah. 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 Yep, yep, yep. Thank you. Shit, I'm trying to get dinged up. We're trying to get dinged up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. I'm in the spirit, though. I heard that. Though. Yeah, then so we can't. We can't. We're going with the flow, bro. We're going with the flow, bro. I've been feeling those scriptures. Hell yeah, you know. We're gonna continue on with this he I, this history lesson to these dumbass Egyptologists. I, I could never walk away from why you right in the middle of it too. Like get the to the good, good part. Yeah, good you part. About get up, leave it at the good part. Well, it ain't for everybody. No, it ain't for everybody. I'm, I'm excited to hear the rest. That's one of the reasons why we fucking still at the bottom of the world. We could have been about it here because of these damn Egyptologists, motherfuckers, mm -hmm. man. Niggas don't want to hear the word. Oh, they just, they, the they word. just they want to go off with the heathen. Well, they just want to follow the heathen period. Don't yeah. you know that you idiots do get up out of here? Hey, Stupid fuck it. Ass. Hey, this is the most highs in control of us, so, you know? Yeah. You do what he do, so we going to get up out of here soon. Now we're going to have that kind of a rap with uh, that story in Judah, where the uh, Moabite dude. He's all looking at you. He's like, much told y'all eyeballing me? He's <laughs> <laughs> even staring at me. Face eyed motherfucker. <laughs> Like the fourth set of my head. He gave me the eye. He looked at these strong legs, right? <laughs> Judas. Yeah, like that uh, story of Judas. <laughs> when the mud fight, uh, they had their whole land round about by the Syrian king. 
Oh, yeah. And uh, yeah. Kasseri King wasn't awesome. familiar with the Israelites up there. And he asked, who is these people? Uh -huh. And Bob might do the whole history about how they came from the water, came out of the land of the Chaldeans. Uh, the most always yeah. with them. And he pretty much told the Assyrian king that, look, if they're going on, we can go up there and take them. But if they're right by their God, we're okay, so leave them alone. Leave them motherfuckers yeah, alone. Cause, right, because when Israel, when Israel's in their right state of mind, they're unstoppable. Unstoppable, man. But you know, it, ain't gonna, it, it ain't gonna happen though. That's Not what I'm on saying. this side, it'll never happen. Stupid ass Egyptologists. Look, there, there's no, you can't, like these motherfuckers think they're gonna save the community. But these got people that actually think we're gonna get everybody together. We're all gonna come together. Mm -hmm. We're gonna we're gonna keep uh, them. We're gonna, all black people. All black people. Let's That's what I mean. Oh what? <laughs> yeah, they don't give a damn about those. No, you got white people. Do, white white people do the same shit. <laughs> it don't really apply to all Israel though, because right, right. all Israel be on that same stupid shit. Same dumb ass. They shit. thinking they all gonna come together. We're gonna build a community. And, man, look, there's no hope for the community. Community's gonna be destroyed. America's gonna be destroyed. There's no. You can't save it. Ain't nobody right. gonna wake up. There's only a few people who's gonna wake up to any kind of truth. It is no hope. The, the motherfuckers just retarded. <laughs> you can't save them. And you ain't gonna save a few. Just a few. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? It's like that many. I think it is punch. Hey, we get that. Ecclesiastes, don't nobody And the Bible says that uh, 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 the gods of the nations and their idols are gonna be broken. And by Al Brif is the god of one of the other nations, man, that Israel was serving gonna be broken like into like you know you drop an ice cube or a glass on the ground you see man that shit just splatters but in this case it's gonna evaporate by nuclear missiles yeah the lord's bringing destruction man the, the lord ain't, he ain't bringing motherfucking unity and happiness and peace on earth man the, the scripture said the lord's we a man of war oh yeah you, yeah we are the world what happened to michael jackson Michael Jackson cop leprosy and dropped dead. Dropped dead. You know what I'm saying? He's a skeleton now. So yeah, so the way that we are the world shit and heal the world, Michael Jackson couldn't heal his damn self. You know what I mean? He's talking about right. heal the world. All that money you power you have? All that power. All this money? Coming out still looking like Man, it, instead of really using his money for something good, he wanted to buy goddamn giraffes and gorillas and shit. <laughs> and never, never roller coasters. And molest their children and pay their families off. Yeah. You know? So yeah, man. And then his ass went off the monkey. Mm. Bubbles, what's the monkey name? Bubbles. Bubbles. Had the monkey laying in bed with him and the kids. That's some bestiality That's shit. That's fucked up too. Yeah, man. Michael Jackson. He was a foul individual. We don't even need to talk about Michael Jackson. There was a foul individual. We need to get back to this country. There was a foul individual. Let me get back to this exit. We need to talk about Michael <laughs> My brother, uh, he made a Michael Jackson fan club. Oh, shit. And he only had like, uh, 12 <laughs> members. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, bro. Look, I ain't gonna say no video. Now, when I was a kid, I had the jacket, bro. Uh, yeah, I had to beat the jacket. I had to beat the jacket. Like the Rosicrucian. I thought I was bad in that motherfucker. All the little girls liked me, bro. Cause I had that jacket. That's what that jacket oh, was. Yeah, 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 yeah. That, well, he was a damn shit. Hell no. I ain't never wanted that motherfucker. I was, I was, I'm I ain't know nothing better. I'm on my ass, man. I was. How was that? You know what I'm saying? Um, uh, Exodus uh, 1 and 11. Therefore, they did set over them taskmasters to afflict them with their burdens and they built for pharaoh treasure cities i was just like you had taskmasters like when america was founded uh you had all this slavery going on and then you had all them uncle toms like your boy steven in uh what's that movie Django? Stevenson. Is that his name? stevenson steven oh, steven stevens what is it yeah it's stevens uh, it's been a steven. oh yeah you know what i'm saying just like in that movie life you ever watch life like, when they was up in prison uh -huh. and then they had that the to go, man, yeah that doesn't make me show you how much sellout niggas is because dude, even my dude didn't even, he didn't even think about the gun line. He didn't even bring it up. He just came out of the woodwork and was like, oh yeah, oh, tell me about the gun line, Paul. Oh yeah, the gun line. <laughs> that, that's a good movie though, Life, man, that's a good one. Oh, you know? Oh, 
Uh-huh. Yeah, and that's another thing to show you too how back then motherfuckers wasn't on that gay faggot shit because remember when dude said he couldn't go home? Because he because he, he wanted up being a faggot in there. Oh, and he, he was getting his release forms and Eddie Murphy was like, you know what I'm saying, what you all so upset for? And he said, I can't go home like this. <laughs> so his ass ran past the gun line you and be, they shot his ass. Oh, you be welcome with open arms now. Yeah, you be a faggot, your mom be happy to see you. How you doing, Shit, baby? The, the dumb bitch will throw a party you know for you. Yeah, she's like, oh, you look but so was you look cute. Yeah, so you look yeah. like you've been working out. Yeah. You, you look know? so cute. And like, here, I bought a dress for right. you. I still, bought a new outfit you. You still you. my baby. Mm-hmm. Like, oh, that lipstick looks good on you. Goes good with your eyes. Wait till your ass come home from prison, too. Wait. These, the these yeah. decorated and shit. Yeah, welcome I'm, home, party. Welcome home, party. Yeah, don't give a fuck. I don't care who you are. Your mom is wicked as hell. Oh, I'm talking to everybody. Yeah, All these women just ain't right. Point blank, period. None of them. I love my mom to death, man. Uh, well, you know what I, I'm just saying. Man. I didn't talk about love. I'm talking about see, they ain't right. You want to see wickedness. Let's go holler at oh, my there, mom. There, Let's there, go yeah. with my mom. Yeah. And man. she'll tell you shit. So you know what's funny about these bitches? If you want to know some scheme, if you want to know a scheme, how to do, so do some slam bar shit, plot as some, a fucking bitch. As a bitch. As a woman. <laughs> oh, you know, I got a scripture. I was just talking about you that. You know, that's true too, yeah, man. As a woman. That's true, man. So if you, if you want to learn these, how to get a bitch, even with a bitch, yeah. with a nigga, man. I mean, these niggas is wicked as fuck too, but these women take it to another level. Yeah, that's not Slam bar. Yeah, because half these bitches you meet, actually all of them, when you meet a bitch, she already got a dude when she's talking to you. Yeah. But you just don't know about it. I know about it. I ain't retarded. It's like, this place is fucked around backwards. Mm. You got women out here with punk back. Yeah, they got, yeah, exactly. Right, right, right. And hey, let me get this scripture real quick. This is hot bitch of lifetime, man. Bitch is hot and delicious, scrumptious looking, clean looking, black like sister, man. Let me get this scripture real quick. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, yo ho, you don't even, if you, yeah, you all bitches watch our videos, you shouldn't even waste your time watching our videos, man. Really. Yeah, if you got sons, sit them in front of the computer. Uh, unless, unless, yeah, unless you watching, you better give one of us your number. That's the only reason you should watch the videos, is to get one of our numbers. Because if you're single, because you, uh, a, uh, a married woman has no business watching our videos. Has no business. Has no business. None. Uh, this is Ecclesiastes 7. And 25. I apply my heart to know and to search and to seek out wisdom and the reason of things and to know the wickedness of folly, even the foolishness and madness. Jeez. Said the fo- And so we're we gonna learn about foolishness and madness. Okay? This is, this is madness and foolishness. And I find bitter more, excuse me, and I find more bitter than death the woman. So it, so. The Lord just said we was talking about foolishness and madness. These hoes out here, they, they in a state of madness. These bitches is like, bro, like, like wild animals. Mother- jackals. They're this. like jackals. They got diseases and shit. Because actually, you be all hyped to get some pussy. But then all of a sudden, after you finally get that pussy and you fuck a bitch, now, now you worried about your dick's going to start burning. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you washing your yeah. shit. After you, as soon as you fuck a bitch, now you're like, oh shit. Yeah. I think I might I wash my, clean my right. shit, scrubbing shit, taking a hot Put ass peroxide on it. Fucking shit. Yeah, you peroxide and alcohol. Are oh, you saying. pouring yeah. everything on your shit, man? And it's just and out it's of it's just out of fear. Like it's just out of a fear, man. You don't know what's going on down yeah. there, man. With yeah, that bitch's like, pussy. But you so we so you you so caught up in this fucking flesh, man. You get weak, man. You get because yeah, you gotta get some pussy. That nut is something to pursue. Yeah, it is. That nut, yeah, that nut. You got you gotta get it out, you know. So so you do some. Don't, you know, cause these, you don't, but, you're stuck in stupid stuff. But even the bitches you don't think got some shit, got some shit. They're the ones you gotta worry about. They gotta worry, yeah. shit. Yeah, the ones you gotta worry about. Yeah, yeah it's herpes. Cute ass bitch. Man, they said like 90% of people got herpes. Damn. Something crazy. I know it's, um. Oh, that was 90 What was it with the black woman? It was maybe, a high that, ass maybe that's what the black woman. The black, black woman, woman, it was like 70%? 60, maybe that's what high it is. High 60s? I'm exaggerating. It was high 60 something percent with yeah. the black woman. 
And that's yeah. just numbers reported. Oh yeah, so I was exactly. That's just numbers but reported. It, it's high though, it's high as fuck. Cause you can go downtown since there's like bitch that works a clerk of courts. Oh yeah. That you walk in there and this bitch got an actual, she's there now, she's oh. been there for, I remember this bitch when I was fucking 18 years old and she's still working there. And the whole time, man, sometimes big ass sore be small and sometimes cover her whole face. Damn. Damn. Yep. Yeah. Well, downtown. That's what we want. Yep. Plus you can have that shit. bad too, man. Plus yeah, you, you can have that shit. It won't even show up for years. Right. Oh, man, all you gotta do is I ain't trying to get people. Oh yeah. <laughs> your, your immune system. You just take shit and make your immune system oh, yeah. strong and shit. Yep. But that's just people that got terrible eating habits and diet. And well, they be doing nasty shit too. Here it is. Like right when I was when I dick after dick. I, I knew a dude that got syphilis in his eye. God, he yeah. I don't even know how. Yeah, he got syphilis fucked up. Because he was fucking. He had was some whore. And he was eating, licking a whore's pussy. I mean, because you know what I mean? These, these bitches are nasty. She, she man. Probably, you know how they, these bitches act like they be coming, right? Probably pissed in his face. Right, he's eating the pussy. Yeah, probably pissed pissed in his face. Oh, yeah. Rub this shit these bitches are nasty, bro. Yep. Wow. That's why. Well, let me read the scripture. Man. Ecclesiastes 7 to 26. And I find more bitter than death the woman whose heart is snares and nets. Goddamn trap, that bitch a trap. And her hands is banned. Who ple whoso pleaseth God shall escape from her. That's right. But the sinner shall be taken by her. That's right. Any, any of us that got a woman, man, you better keep your mind, ain't your woman. Yeah, they, they, you better right. keep your God. You better keep yeah. your eye on that bitch. That bitch yeah. don't belong to you. She'll trap your ass. First of all, you live in America. And a bitch, you could be married to a bitch, so-called married. Right, right. But she can leave you at any time she wants. And right. if you have a problem with it, she's called a cop. You know what I'm saying? So when get in your mind, that bitch is just on lease. Yeah, you just leasing that home. That's yeah. right. She, yeah, they can. You, that bitch can be gone at any second. You know what I'm saying? You that live wicked ass bitches, man. And That's these bitches have babies by a man, motherfucker, and they still. You ain't shit to that hoe. It's not even a lease. It's like a batting lineup. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. batting yeah. lineup, yeah. yeah. Actually, that's when you actually go lose your status with these hoes is when you start having babies with them. You yeah. ain't have no kids with them. They still be on you, man. That's when it, they get mad at you after. When they, yeah, something about the kids. As soon something as, about them kids. As soon as that, that little baby come out, she, she start flipping out, going crazy. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? They, they try to get that money. That's their motive. Drive, that's their, draw you yeah. away. That's their motive. So they fuck paid. you hoes, man. That's their you motive. hoes ain't shit. That's their motive, yeah. That's why all you can do is just fuck a bitch. And that, just, all you can do is just play it. Just, you just play games with these bitches. That's yeah, all you can yeah. do. Get your turn to hit the ball. That's the whole object of the game. Make sure you keep winning. You gotta, play, you gotta, you know, you gotta play mind games. With yeah, them. you gotta play. Yeah, you gotta fuck with their brain, fuck and with this, their mind. This is definitely not the time era, time frame to be even lovey dubby with these hoes. Yeah. Nah, this ain't the time for that. Cause you gotta be wise, man. Shoot. Let me read it. for everything. A lot of time, I'm telling you, man, I'm laid up with a bitch, man. It can't help but pop in my head. Damn, this bitch is my other nigga, man. Uh, every right. time I'm thinking, yeah. Every like, time. Why, why you hit it? Like, God damn, I know this hey. bitch done built with all. Cause she done hey. told me about it. Like, God damn. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Real, real. And that's adultery, actually. They love talking about them niggas, but they don't, don't mention no other girl. That's uncleanliness, man. Yeah. That's filthy. You know, you can't... Ha there's, there's very few people who can say their woman has only been with them. Right. Very few. Right. I, don't, I don't know any. Yeah, I don't know any. I don't know any. And if they did, she, you might have had her for a minute, but eventually she left your ass. Yeah, she, you know what I mean? She crept. <laughs> I mean, I don't know anybody that stays married no more. Uh, there's no, there's uh, no families no more. That's just out the window. Uh, it's out the goddamn window. Uh, the only people who's, uh, the families, and they breaking up now too, is the Mexicans, the Issachar. Yeah, they they starting uh, start to get them now. Or them heathens like Ham and, uh, and, uh, and uh, Ishmael. Yep. Yeah, that's you it, yeah. I got some Ham mice. Next goddamn door. Ham mice. Fucking filthy motherfucker. Oh, yeah, let me finish this up. And I find more bitter than the death the woman whose heart is snares and nets and her hands is banned. Whoso pleases God shall escape from her, but the sinner shall be taken by her. It's like, oh, oh yeah, because these motherfuckers ain't got no knowledge and no wisdom and they got no common sense. Uh, they, they get hustled by these women left and right and the women just play with them and they control them. And we be telling people, we tell, we like, uh, like your boy Dave, he's fucking that one. 
Your, my, your boy Dave, that bitch had his ass outside sweeping the sweeping parking lot. The park look, park look. An apartment complex parking lot. Did this bitch had him outside sweeping the apartment complex's parking lot. That's just, that, that was, that's and he, I, Dave, and peel. And Dave, that's if you, And Dave, if you watching the video, you know this is true. I got to go in it for truth's sake. Yeah, that's all this. Ain't oh, you tried to get your number off me. Well, it's just a testimony. You just testifying. Because Dave, you know Dave. she had your ass out. Because look. I didn't respond back. Well, hold up. We could Dave watch our videos. He'll see this. So Dave, you know, you know, we ain't fucking with you. We just come out with the truth. But you know. I gave him a chance. He asked me for the broom. He's like, Aaron, you know where the broom at? He's like, I'm about to sweep the kitchen. I was like, oh, for real? I was like, okay, go ahead. Sweep. There you go. There's a broom right there. He snuck out the back door because he knew I was going to clown on him. <laughs> and he went out and that bitch had him. I don't him. remember that shit. I ain't going to never forget that. That, bit, all going out the front. that bitch had him sweeping the parking lot. I looked outside. He was, I, I prayed. I wish I would have got it on camera. You know what I mean? But it wasn't meant to be. He sweeping that day, bro. He, that, that's just man, we was having fun that's back how, then. That wicked asshole. We was having fun back then. Oh, yeah. But we told we Dave were. about that wicked hoe. I'm telling you, there's a lot of things you missed. Yeah. A lot oh, of shit, shit. you missed. There's more fun times ahead. Yeah, yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. The scripture is that. Oh, this is Ecclesiastes 7. Ecclesiastes 7. Yeah, towards the bottom. You see, uh... That's what I was. Oh, go ahead. I'm about to read it right here. 7 and 27. Behold, this have I found, saith the preacher, counting one by one to <laughs> find out the account. It's an experiment that he did. Well, yeah, he did a poll. <laughs> a poll. <laughs> he said, which yet my soul <laughs> seeketh. But I find not one man among a thousand have I found. So he said, I only, I only found one righteous man among every thousand men. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's like we were saying earlier, like most people ain't going to get the truth. Precious gold. Most people ain't going to wake up. There's no hope. Precious gold, yeah. For most people, there's just no fucking hope. Yeah. Like like the scriptures say, you got to dust your feet on them fools. He said one man. He said, yeah, he said one man among a thousand have I found. But a woman among all those have I not found. So not the, the Lord just ain't, don't give a fuck about, the Lord ain't dealing with women, you know what I'm saying? You know, there probably was more women back then too. More women back then. But you see in America though. Always, the numbers always been like that. Women not women. But you see in America though, but who's the biggest leaders right now? The fuck the leader of the Tea Party. Y'all call yourself revolutionaries. Your leader, Sarah Palin. Fine ass Sarah Palin. Yeah. She's stupid. Oh, uh, yeah. She, she look, I think I seen you her in a porno or something. She is dumb as hell. Yeah, but Sarah. Yeah, she's retarded. So but, but here it is. You're like, your top leaders are women. The leader of the Democrats beside Barack Obama's Hillary Clinton. A goddamn lesbo. You know, a witch and a sorceress. A woman, they got women, and they talking about Hillary going to be the top candidate for the Democrats. She, she ain't going to get in office. Ain't well, I'm just saying, it's know, all the I'm women. And they had Nancy Pelosi, that fucking oh, slut. God, damn. And she's one of their top leaders. What's the other bitch, Dianne Feinstein? I'll say she was president before Hillary. Oh, an, an, another leader, Michelle Bachman. She a so-called patriot Bachman. leader. She got all these women leading. Yep. No wonder your shit's all fucked up. You got right. women running shit. Right, right. You, you going into a courtroom to get judged, and you got a goddamn bitch on a period up on the goddamn seat. Yeah, right, right. You know right. what I'm right. saying? Right. That scripture says, they that lead thee, talking about these yeah. women, lead thee to air. Let me get that real quick. Yeah. Dumb ass hoes, man. They got no business doing shit. When you go to uh, work, you apply for a job that goddamn manages a woman. They ain't gonna let no, hardly no men be managers. If you ain't sexy and cute enough, I ain't hiring you. Yeah, exactly. They ain't gonna give you no job, man. If you ain't got no game, nigga, I ain't hiring you. Well, you know what? <laughs> I, 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 uh, That's all you got. That's one point I was thinking of. Uh, that's good for America that these women be up here because that's how Egypt fell. How did you Cleopatra. <laughs> Oh yeah, that bitch, she was uh, running shit. Yeah, after Cleopatra, Egypt was done. There's not too many good women leaders you know of. I mean, you had Queen Elizabeth, but she had men controlling that shit, you know what I mean? Yeah, She, yeah. she had counselors and advisors. How many Cleopatras were there? Oh, there's a whole bunch of Cleopatras. I'm just, I've been looking for that answer, man. I still can't find the answer on the Cleopatra. That's what I was on Wikipedia. As a matter of fact, is it? That's yeah. why I was on Wikipedia. I ain't... They got most of them homies on there, yeah. sure. Here you go. Um, What's a damn Edomites? Isaiah 3 and 12. As for my people, Children are their oppressors. Children are oppressors. And oh, why, why? Yeah. You got, 
Right, like in America, if you go to whip your kid, they can actually call the cops and the cops are coming to arrest you for whipping your child. Yeah. I mean, this is some faggot shit out here, man. Hey, child support, that's the number one oppress. Exactly, all these cops should be put to death. All, all these judges, the Lord's gonna put all them judges to death. He, he gonna, sure is. He put all these cops to death. He sure is. All, all these motherfucking uh, children's services agents, what they call them, the uh, social services. Social they services. all gonna be put to death. That's right. That's I mean, right. they gonna be put. It's gonna be a gruesome death. Guaranteed death. It's a guaranteed death. It's just a matter of time. I mean, all y'all get put to death, mm -hmm. man. It ain't no what if. All these motherfuckers will work for the IRS. You all get the Lord is gonna put all you to death. That's all according to the Bible. You know what I'm saying? Right. These can't put to death. Go ahead. Children are their oppressors and women rule over them. O oh, my people, they which lead thee, cause thee to err and destroy the way of thy path. Yeah, so all the leaders cause y'all motherfuckers to err. Especially the government. Politics is a joke. They say Congress got a 10% approval rating. Damn. You know what I'm saying? 10% got sense. And then all your so-called uh, black leader, who's they black? They ain't no, they ain't no such thing as no black leaders. We got Al Sharpton. Yeah, yeah. He's a fucking joke. Uh, black means great they, 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 they a joke. So we got all kind of black leaders. Well, who you got? Polite? He ain't no goddamn leader. That dude's a cartoon character. No light. Polite, no motherfucking <laughs> Sarah Supersetti. Give me this bitch. Man, his God. His God, the black woman. Ain't nobody listening to nothing y'all saying, man. <laughs> Not a fucking thing. They ain't listening to shit y'all saying. It sounds good to them for a minute, but they get bored with you after a while. <laughs> you know what I mean? You can only take that shit for so long. <laughs> and then they gotta move. They go, they'd rather, most people rather play Madden than PlayStation and listen to your I ass. I saw a video they saying. had, that motherfucking video was like six hours or something long. I'm talking about nothing. Gonna watch that about shit. nothing. They, they opened that one book. <laughs> just talking and just talking. Just talking. Kicking it. Talking some shit. I saw one video, they handled around Hennessy. God damn. <laughs> I mean, there's nothing wrong with that, though. I know, but they, yeah, man, that's the yeah, only way you can take yeah. that shit. Oh, yeah, yeah they, you got me drunk to You got to be that drunk shit. to take that shit. <laughs> so I wish I had me some fucking drink right now. Yeah, shit. That sounds delicious right you now. Drink some drink. I, cause I, I, strong drink. I be in the spirit when I'm drunk, too. Boy. I, strong I hit, drink. I, when I get drunk, I hit y'all with all kind of scripture. Yeah. <laughs> Here you go. This Ecclesiastes 25 and 24. The beginning of sin. So the woman that goes all the way back to the Garden of Eden. Because when the serpent came up, the serpent represents a wicked man. It was not an actual snake. You know, sometimes we gotta say that because people don't know nothing. Yeah, they actually think it was a reptile. Right. So the <laughs> serpent represents a wicked man, just like Esau. Reptilian python. Yeah, the reptilian. <laughs> <laughs> but he wasn't an actual reptilian. Don't get no ideas. <laughs> yeah, he was. Baby, he was a rep. You know what I'm saying? He had. You're right, he was a damn snake. <laughs> but look, so the serpent went to the woman. Why do they go to the woman? Because the woman's easier to manipulate. So that's how they do it in America. In you America, black queen, our goddess. That's how they separate the family in America was through the woman. That's like a woman in America could go uh, abort your baby. Ain't nothing you could do about it. She has power because she's a goddess. That's because the serpent go to the woman. <laughs> Just like he'll get the, 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 the uh, woman will always get custody. Even though the man's more strong and more physically able to protect a child. Physically and mentally, bro. And, yeah, and, and mentally, well, exactly. Then, but they still gonna give it to the goddamn woman. Damn right. Because the serpent, right that's, that's, why, but that's why the scriptures say the serpent went to the woman. Yeah, that's his promise to that bitch, to your black goddess. She just sees the most high and her husband. Well, well yeah, yeah, and then, and that's, because really, yeah, Adam was going off. He was weak, you know what I'm saying? Good ass. Yeah, that's what we did. The first pussy, that was what we talking about some pure pussy, you know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody hitting that, but your boys. Like, some probably smell like oils. Oh, yeah, that's what we did. like oils. <laughs> yeah, that's a, Woo! God a, after the ages, it done got down. worn out, though. God damn. Yeah, this is, that, this is thousands of years later. That pussy ain't what like it used to be. With a tattoo on the ass. Oh, uh, no, got paw prints on the titties. <laughs> Oh, you know what I mean? Nah, bitch got their clip pierced now. Oh, yeah. I used to have they one got their clip pierced, their tongue pierced, yeah. they, they yeah. motherfucking side of their mouth pierced. Yeah. <laughs> Motherfuckers got every goddamn thing pierced. Yeah. Eve exercise, yeah, they get, too. They, 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 get they, they get their butt cheeks pierced. <laughs> <laughs> they do that they shit. They get man. everything pierced, man. She Eve nut exercise. She was always out and about. You know? Fucking nut ass hugs. Running around in the Garden of Eden. Shit. 
Whew. I got scripture after you get done. Of the woman came ahead. the beginning of sin, and through her, we all died. Oh, yeah, so, right, we all died. That's because she. Simple. That's because when the serpent, that's why we coming up on. That's funny, too. We coming up on Christmas. Like, that's why that Christmas tree represents Eve eating that fruit. Like we, like we always say, like that Christmas tree represents the tree of knowledge of good and evil. And those little Christmas balls, that's that forbidden fruit. That go all the way back to when the serpent came up to Eve and gave her that fruit. I got that. Oh, uh, what you got? Really, and really the scriptures say that that fruit was pleasing to the eyes. What did it say? In Genesis uh, 3, I'm like, it was glistening. I'm about to get it. Here you go. This is Timothy. This is 1 Timothy 2 and 13. For Adam was first formed, then Eve. And Adam was not deceived, but the woman being deceived was in transgression. How's that for your black goddess, your black queen? Sorry, nigga. I got, let me read this. And I got brother, so, I no brother, got, uh, brother, no I light. Oh yeah. And uh, this is uh, yeah, but we ain't saying we don't like women. We like to fuck the shit out of these bitches. You know what I mean? But facts. I mean, but we, we we know we know what we live in. We live in a fucking shithole piece of shit America. You ain't got no woman. You ain't got no wife. You ain't got no family. Right. You ain't got no children. Your children belong to the damn state. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ain't shit you can do. They, you gotta send them to school. Mm -hmm. and, and if you don't send them to school and you homeschool them, you still gotta let the government know what you're doing. You know, you know, you know. My teenage daughter, sixteen year old daughter, told me yesterday. Like dad, I don't want to be around mom. Yeah. <laughs> She's she, I don't want to be around mom. I don't. There you go. What can Here I do is. about? It? I can't do shit about it. My little, my I little, can't do shit about it. My little sons tell me that all the time. They tell mm -hmm. me they hate their mom. Yeah. I mean, I tell them that you ain't supposed to love your mother. I tell them that, but but they, but they, you, you see what the bitches be be so damn evil. Right. You know what I'm saying? I had a nerve to tell my daughter, and she told me that. Yeah, mom said if I'm a, if I'm gonna get a man. Find one that wears a suit. Kind of shit was that? Like breeding them. Too. That's some wicked bitch, man. Yeah, man. Most High gonna fuck her up, man. I already told her Perfect. last time I talked to her. I said it's a, it's a matter of time before the Most High kill you, bitch. Oh yeah. I told her that. This it's scripture, last time. Shit, this scripture, scripture covers that. Matter of fucking time before the Most High kill you, ass, bitch. All right, here we go. Micah seven and ten. Whew. Then she that is my enemy Whew. shall see it, and shame shall cover her. Well, which she, said unto me, where is the Lord right. that oh, God? Oh, yeah. Is she who is my goddess? Yeah, because these <laughs> bitches tell you that, too. Especially now, I do, because I got my baby's mama. And she got a pro. She knows I teach the Bible. You know what I'm saying? And uh, she got a problem with it, you know? Because she don't want to be associated with anybody that does this. But, but she always says that. It's like, where's your God ain't going to do shit? She ain't going to help you. Be, you know, make a fun of you. Like, yeah, that's like it's a joke. Too. That's scriptural too. You know what I'm saying? Always, always too. making it. Right it's like that's it's a big that. joke. Yeah. Yeah. Right like they ain't got no faith in the most high whatsoever. It's just a big joke. But she got, she got faith in 911 though. Bitch called right. the cops on me like, what, two weeks ago. Damn. You know what I'm saying? She got faith in the cops. But I just talked in a loud voice. She's like, 911, 911. Really? Yeah, barely even said nothing. I went. I just started raising my voice. I cursed out a little bit. She got scared. And called the cops. <laughs> Bitches are call. They quick to call the cops on your ass, you man. Speed down. And then a bitch can lie. You ain't even got to hit her or nothing. The, the cops don't care because they a bunch of faggots, a bunch of cap and saber hoes. You going straight to jail. That's wild. That's wild. That's one of these days is gonna come. She gonna call. The, she gonna call the cops, and it's gonna be the, the time that one of her brothers gonna answer the phone. That, pro that proves all them cops ain't right. They should never even follow. That's an unlawful order. You ain't supposed to follow unlawful orders. You know what I'm saying? Because they're going totally against the most high, man. This is something You tell them it's against the most high. They're they going to definitely do the opposite thing. That's yeah, good, though. The opposite. Soon ain't going to be no goddamn 911. Hey, that's right. That's all you bitches got is 911. 911 gonna lose 911. Hey, same thing with these faggot men too. We got they call 911 on us for teaching the Bible. A man, yeah, men, grown men. ass men, all the time. Happens all the time. That shit totally backfired on dude. Oh yeah. <laughs> Let me finish this. Oh, go ahead. Micah seven and ten. Micah seven and ten. Then she that is my enemy shall see it, and shame shall cover her, which said unto me. Where is the Lord thy God? That's what he was just saying. My eyes shall behold her. Now, 
shall she be trotted down as the mire of the streets. Ooh, y'all hoes gonna be trotted down the mire and the mud in the street. Like turn you have your fa face down in the mud, you gonna yeah. get trampled you by get horses. Yeah. You, get, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Pounded. Yeah. They yeah. get pounded with your, yeah, your face. You gonna be put into a low position. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Which uh, uh, call that bitch got stupid my horses on. Yeah, yeah I just, uh, oh, you know what? Oh, she got chewed, yeah, chewed up. Stop. Yeah, Stop. chewed up by a damn dog and <laughs> shit. She got fucked up. Cause all these bitches, they got that Jezebel spirit on them. You know what I'm saying? That's in the scripture, so there's nothing that y'all hoes can do about that. These, these hoes are the main reason why people ain't found the truth. You know what I'm saying? Cause, Cause you got a lot of people who thinking about going out and teaching, but they can't cause of their wife and hold them back. You know what I'm saying? Now let me read the scripture. Genesis uh, three and one. Now the serpent was more subtle than any beast of the field. Like I said, a serpent, that's a wicked man. That's Esau, okay? Like today, that's talking about yeah, the so-called white man. That's talking about uh, like the elite, the pe motherfuckers running shit the, with the puppeteers. You know what I'm saying? The puppeteers, yeah, that's exactly what they are. Uh, yeah, now the serpent was more subtle than any beast of the field which the Lord God had made. And he said unto the woman, Yea, hath God said, Ye shall not eat of every tree of the garden. And the woman said unto the serpent, We may eat of the fruit of the trees of the garden, but of the fruit of the tree which is in the midst of the garden, God hath said, Ye shall not eat of it, neither shall ye touch it, lest ye die. For example, uh, uh, Egyptology, Islam, yeah, you ain't supposed Buddhism. To, you, ain't supposed, you ain't supposed to eat that fruit. That's a rotten <laughs> fruit. Know. That fruit got worms up in it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Got them caterpillars maggots. up in the maggots. Yeah, you got yeah. That fruit is rotted. It's a rotten fruit. Chlamydia. <laughs> yeah, got, yeah, got a motherfucker. What's that shit? The uh, what's that diarrhea called? No, uh, <laughs> what's that shit? They all, you can't. What's that fruit poison and shit? Salmonella. E. coli. Yeah, yeah. E. coli, salmonella. All the, yeah, you gonna be shitting. You give you the shit. Your ass gonna have diarrhea for a goddamn two months after listening to Sarah Suit Seti yeah. or coli. God, you trying to ah, you fuck, hey, you fucked up your whole stomach started bubbling. <laughs> your whole life is like, <laughs> <laughs> that's what happened. Life got real. Yeah, yeah. Life got real. It shit make you nauseous and shit. <laughs> like fuck, I gotta get out of here. Where's this freaking street? Yeah, we found it. There was like 60. Yeah, is it? Yeah, you know, I know. Like that, it's cold, man. It's really that cold? It's 28 degrees. Damn, it feels kind of good. It feels like about 20 something. Damn. Shit. Damn. Shit, it's like, it's like a thousand degrees out here with this fire. <laughs> it said, but a fruit of the tree which is in the midst of the garden, God's.